Hey everyone! Today I'm going to share with you some of my new products that are my favorites and some of them I've just used for the first time today and some of them I've used maybe two or three times. So let's get started. First is the Naked Palette by Urban Decay, which most of you know about. The colors that I use today are Gunmetal, Sin, and then I also, for my lid, I used another palette that I have because the Naked Palette didn't have like a bluish gray color that I needed for my outfit, which is right here. It's by Wet n Wild, so I just kind of mixed that in before I used my Naked Palette. The color is the eyelid color on this, this uh, 385B Trio. Okay, before all that, I used, this is one of my other favorite. Um, I've used this, I think, three times now. It's the Shadow Insurance by Too Faced. This is something I picked up a couple days ago at Walmart, the NYC Concealer in 782A Medium. I use it for um, some sunspots that I have. It doesn't completely conceal them, but it, it helps a little bit. Uh, what I really like about it is I actually put it on my lips before my lipstick. I tried that today, and um, I'm going to see how that, that works. But I just like the way it goes on, and I like the coverage that it gives. Another thing I tried, I, I'm not using this today, but this is the Wet n Wild Mega Last. And I got it in the color of 363A. It is like a sort of a coffee shimmer color. It's got a tiny bit of a plum mixed in with it, plum color. And um, I like it with my brown eyes and dark hair. And then this is the balm that you put atop it so it stays nice and put on your lips. What I am using today is the Lancome in Groupie. It's a shimmer. And I really like the casing. It's got a cute little um, bubble flower on the end of it. Um, something that I tried, this is the second time I've used it, and I completely love the coverage that it gives. And I love the, just, it's so even. It's the Revlon Photo Ready. I just love this. I think it's going to be my new favorite. It's not too heavy for me. I just, I don't use very much. I just use like two pumps, um, not even full pumps. And I just stipple it on and then blend it with my foundation brush. Okay, this is called High Brow by Benefit. I showed this in my Sephora haul last weekend. And it is, I used it up here on my brow bone instead of a shadow. Because um, up here, that's where I used the Sin color, I believe, from the Naked Palette. This has a tiny bit of a pink to it, um, which kind of gives it more of a petite look. Instead of having such a sharp white color, it's more kind of a kind of a tamed down look. And then I just blended it with, with my blending brush. Another product that I just love to death is the Maybelline New York Eye Studio Eyeliner, and I like the black. Uh, the actual color is called Charcoal, and I don't have it on today. I have on the 24-7 Urban Decay. It's in the Naked palette, but I just love this. Uh, the brush that comes with it is this. It's just a real fine, flat brush. But this stuff, it stays on. It doesn't run. doesn't bleed. It's really nice. I love this. It's the Hot Mama for Iathis at Sephora. It's blush. So this is the balm down here. And the packaging is so cute. This one actually has a gold, sorry about the mirror, <laughs> kind of has a gold tinge to it. 
This is perfect for me. I just put two swipes on, you know, two dabs and a couple swipes, and it's just perfect. I don't even have to put anything over it to blend it. It's so blendy. And then this is, I use this for the first time. It's a little bit bulky to put in your purse, but it's just something about the packaging I love. This is um, color 747. It's the medium natural blend by Wet n Wild. And it's so cute. It has a little kabuki in it. It's fairly soft. It's a little bit firm, but it's it's not it's soft. Um, but it, you can have control over you know where it goes. It's not real loose uh, bristles, but they don't poke your face. And the packaging is very hard, thick plastic. Drop right fits right in there, and it has a little base to it, and then. Screws right on. It's adorable. And it has a bigger base so it doesn't tip over. This, I love it. It's And I don't normally, I mean, I have recently been using eyebrow pencils, but not. it's not something I used to use like a must-have. But it is now because I just I found a product that I love. It's by Benefit. It's the Instant Brow Pencil. And it's a brown color, medium to dark. And it needs to be sharpened, but... It's kind of a copper brown, not a shimmer, just kind of a coppery brown color. And the brush on the other end is what I like about it. It's got kind of like a hard mascara wand type deal. You can just brush your, brush your, um, sorry, brush them. It's just real soft. I just love it. And the color's perfect for my eyebrows. It matches perfectly. Okay. I, I have a Wet n Wild lip pencil, and the reason I bought another one is, or another lip pencil is because I found out that you really need to get a lip liner to match, uh, as close as you can to match your natural lip color. So what I do is I line my lips with this. This is just about perfect for my lips. I have fairly uh, pigmented lips anyway, just natural, so I don't wear lipstick a whole lot, but I really like to. So this, you could even get away with just wearing this um, on your lips if you colored in all your lips. But I first lined my lips with it. And then today, I used my Lancome that I showed you earlier. And I put that on with a, a lip brush. And then after that, I put on some uh, Buxom lip, lip gloss. My last thing in my favorites for now is the Rimmel Max Bold Curves and I don't think this one's the waterproof. I actually meant to get the waterproof but this is fine. It does a great job. It really extends my lashes. It doesn't get um, clumpy at all. I just I just curl my lashes before I put it on and this just glides right on. I just do like two coats each on my top and bottom and it's not clumpy or anything. I like it. So that's my favorites for today. <laughs> not to say I don't have any more because I have a bunch of new favorites, but I, you know, this is only a 10 minute video or less. So um, if you do your favorites for today, just video response it in my comments and I'll be glad to look at that. Let me know what you think of my look for today and I can tell you all the products that I used. Thanks for watching. Bye.